after a nice break for everyone, the class are empty again today. <laughs> the uh, bus is not running, but uh, looking forward to get back to uh, the run of things in the next couple of days here. Uh, a lot of senior students especially probably enjoyed the day off today. It's been a little hectic. Uh, senior girls volleyball team just took place, took part in the, their off championship at Lakefield High School, somewhere in southern Ontario. Uh, they posted a 1-5 record. It was a great opportunity for them uh, because as if it were a regular season this year, we'd, they probably never would have got the chance to go, but the way it all worked out, they got to go. Uh, otherwise, most senior students have started hearing from universities and colleges as well as lining up apprenticeships for trades. It's a hectic time of the year and uh, trying to plan out everything for your future. People are scrambling to get their hours done, apply for scholarships, <coughs> and ultimately decide where they want to head in the next four years or so. Uh, curling and Nordic ski teams had a strong showing in a few different events this month. Their season will be rocking up in the next few weeks. As well, the boys and girls hockey teams are both in Southern Ontario for their respected Austin Championships. The boys start playing Thursday, while I believe the girls are wrapping up theirs today. The course sports season finished up at the end of the Northland Cup. The junior girls won their league, and all the other teams did very well. The Thursday before the March break, there's a Lenten reconciliation prayer service in the gym, uh, followed by a sacrament of reconciliation being carried out in the chapel with Father Rudy and Father Don. This time with priests was a great way for students to clear their minds as we approach the end of Lenten season. And uh, re I recently returned from a trip to Ottawa in February. I headed there by myself for the Forum for Young Canadians. The goal of the Forum is to inform interested Canadians, Canadian youth in the into the world and operation of politics. The week involved various tours of government buildings, information, information sessions with different government organizations like the Econo uh, Economic Development, Export Development Canada, and my favorite part was the issue stimulations. We formed groups and took, topics, took on topics like Arctic sovereignty, public finance, and international trade. It was an amazing opportunity for me, and I gained lots of valuable knowledge as, as well. Most uh, met a lot of amazing people. Uh, as the Lenten season wrap ups, wraps up, this week, uh, next week we'll have a Holy Thursday prayer service and take Good Friday and Easter Monday to celebrate Easter with our families.